Good morning, ACA Lions. It's Wednesday, August 24th. I'm Pastor Jason. And I'm Miss Goodbread. Let's all please stand for the playing of our national anthem and our pledges. Say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hail? At the twilight last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight, o'er the ramparts we watched, were so gallantly streaming, and the rocket's red glare, the bombs bursting in. That our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star spangled banner yet wave o'er the land of the free and the home of the brave? Amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the Bible, God's holy word. I'll make it a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. I'll hide his words in my heart that I may not sin against God. I pledge allegiance to the Christian flag and to the Savior whose kingdom it stands. One Savior, crucified, risen and coming again with life and liberty to all who believe. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. On today's news, we have our teacher highlight of the week, Dr. C, who has been doing great things with the aviation program, so let's go ahead and check that out. I want that. I want that. I want that. I want that. No. I want that. I want that. Welcome back, students. I want to tell you about some other awesome things that are going on here on campus. One is, of course, Caught You Doing Something Good, aka Blue Slips. This is an awesome program that we have throughout the campus from K through 12th grade. And it's based on Luke chapter 10 with the, the parable of the Good Samaritan, where this person went above and beyond to do something that may not necessarily be something they had to do, but did it anyways. For example, let me tell you a couple highlights of people. These are real shout outs. These are real shout outs. These wow, are live guys. people already got blue slips in the All box right. up front there. But what it is like one of our juniors, our 11th grader, Hunter Redder, was caught by Mr. Dorn just helping clean the classroom, just doing it, not being asked. Blue slip. Another one of our students in our four or five combo. Some of you may know him, but Paco Ibarra. This student in his class with Mrs. Peltz, he actually went and found a friend that was a brand new student at ACA. And when they had to work with a buddy, he went and picked him out just to make him feel welcome. That's what we talk about when you're caught doing something good. So caught you doing something good, these blue slips are dropped in the front office and you get to put those in there. And at the first chapel of every single month, we do a drawing. And at that drawing, it's a pizza party, pizza with the principals and also Miss Good Bread. And so we're going to hang out and be looking out for that first drawing on the first chapel in September. That's awesome. And you guys keep it up. Shout out to those guys. If they're in your class right now, let's go ahead and give them an applause. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What do you look forward to this week, Pastor Jason and ACA? We have our picture day, which is tomorrow. Oh, so make sure, boys, yep. get that haircut going it's time. on. time. Picture day is happening, so please be prepared for that, as well as our teachers. We are going to have a great day. On Monday, of course, we're going to have our first chapel of the school year that's going to be happening this kickoff. So I also want to throw out to you, some of you have been talking to me about, hey, we could play musical instruments. If you're interested in providing some praise and worship, maybe you play the piano, maybe you play the drums, or maybe you got those vocals that you want to actually be able to sing and lead the praise and worship, then make sure to come and see me because we're putting together a praise and worship team for this school year. That would be awesome. Well, in today's current events, we have some really exciting things happening on our campus with our people that we look up to. Yes. So we have Pastor Doug, who's our senior pastor. Pastor Jason's going to tell us a little bit about what he's doing in our community. Well, for those of you that have never maybe attended Victory Church, which is our church for the school, 
Pastor Doug is the senior pastor, and he's actually been running for State House Representative 39. And so in today's current events, he actually won the seat for the Republican Party to be able to run for that seat in Tallahassee. So let's go ahead and let's get out to a special segment with our pastor, Pastor Doug. Hey guys, I'm here with Pastor Doug, the one that just won the District 39 for us. What inspired you to run for well, you know, of course, everything that we do, we do because of the Lord touching our heart or something. But what I saw is things happening in our nation that are affecting our future generations, the kids that are coming. You know, I've enjoyed it going up. I've been able to grow up in a place that honored God. But things are happening in our nation that are trying to push God out. And so for this next generation, that's really what moves me and motivates me. So that that liberty that we have, that we can pass it on to you. And so, uh, you know, just knowing that it's pleasing to the Lord, it gives your heart joy. And so I'm excited. That's what really moved me forward. Thank you for sharing. Back to you guys. That looked like an exciting night for everybody involved. And we just want to say a huge congratulations to Pastor Doug and all those who helped him get that seat in the house. So, Pastor Jason, you want to go ahead and close up in a word of prayer? Let's end with prayer today. Well, Heavenly Father, thank you for this great day, for this Wednesday. And so, Lord, we just give you praise for all that you've been doing. And thank you, Lord, for what's been happening at school. Thank you, Lord, for the remainder of this week that you're with us in everything you do. Thank you that you're with us in our families, Lord, and that, Lord, even as we go home, that you are with us in all those areas. And so, Lord, we just pray for the rest of this week that it's an awesome, incredible week because, God, you're with us in everything. And we give you the praise for this in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. Well, thank you for joining us for another edition of The Lion's Den. I'm Pastor Jason. And I'm Miss Goodbread. And this has been your Daily, Daily Roar. Roar.